Dragon. Is that Dead Man's Respite? That's Ron Geek's Fast. I want to go to Dead Man's Respite. Because good experience. Oh, giants are, whoop! Another entry into the Skyrim space program. Hello, welcome. Just, uh, oh, there he is. He's coming back down. And bouncing. And we got a floating battle axe, it looks like. Yeah, I'm streaming later than usual. I had a lot of stuff going on in my normal life, my real life. And got that all sorted out and I figured eh, I have time to stream I will stream and Miranda is just wandering she's gonna wander up to Winterhold because there's an ancient enchanter there uh, I don't think she has any she doesn't have any grand soul gems She needs to get white es uh, light essence so that she can make some goddess blessing gems. That's the plan there. <laughs> Skyrim physics is really fun. It's a house. Let's see what's in the house. I see a dragon. She can actually handle dragons now, because she's level 20. I hear you, Dagrin. There he is. Oh, it's just one of those, like the Crabber's Shanty or whatever. Really interesting place to put a house. I like that. <clears throat> I'd live here. Oh, it is the Crabber Shanty. Oh, dragon. I'm doing my best, lady. I also need to get her a mirror shield. Oh, she hasn't 
uh, I need to find the mirror shield of the desert. So I think... I know Wintermoon found one of them. Miranda could find the other. I'm getting out. Right in the dog. I mean, noggin, noggin. Right in the noggin. <laughs> That's a long story, lady. Alright, what we got here? Banded iron shield or dwindling fire. That's pleasant. Um, I mean, I guess I could learn... I think I have room for it. Let's take it. Take, take it. So I can learn that enchantment. This lag will stop once I enter Deadman's Respite. I think it's caused by Don, Dindo LOD. There we go. All right. Let's grab some of these books. Okay, Dead Man's Respite. Let's find the tunic in here. I believe it's Woodfall Tunic. thought it would stop. It'll stop eventually. I'm not too worried about it. Hello, friends. Go back to sleep. Oh, I see you. Get out of here. No. Don't look at me. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, look! Sword of Defense. I take. That's from Artifacts of Ultima. It's a good old Sword of Defense. There's this guy. I think what I'm gonna do is save and then quick save and then quick load. Just to see if that kind of resets the... Because it's going to be very hard to fight any uh, Dragon Priest if there's that kind of hanging. I know it always resolves itself. So I don't have to worry too much. Also, I need to check Miranda's face. I think her face is fine. I think Project Proteus has its crap in a backpack. In that regard, yeah. Her face is fine. Alright, it's still doing that, but I'm not too worried. It'll fix itself eventually. I really like these ro um, rotating doors. I want to use them in a dungeon at some point. Oh, look. Huh? I just blew air on it and unlocked. Interesting. Okay, well... That's good to know. I'll have to keep that in mind. Next time I see a chest, I'm gonna blow air on it. Ruined book. Oh, hey! I 
I see you over there. I think the kill cam actually saved me. Because that trap activated and I got into that kill cam and it like warped me forward. So I think I actually got saved by that. <laughs> That's pretty fun. Don't stand on that. Oh, I was gonna sneak you. Starting to hang differently. I'm not gonna comment on the hanging anymore. It's starting to get its act together. Oh, hello, Skulltula. Oh, wait. Dang it. I pulled it and they were on the wrong one. Take the skull to the chitin. Nice goblets. Take the frostbite venom. Actually, you know what I should do is recharge this dagger. Oh, that's a surprise. <laughs> Got a smiling face there. Okay. Anything in there? I don't see anything. There's a... Oh, I wanted the petty soul gem. And really, I don't really want the petty soul gem. Alright, let's head down. Gotta check every nook and cranny, because that crazy J. Kalanad hides things so well. He should make things easier. Skeever! Oh, I remember this. I love this. I don't know. Now, actually, no, it's not this one, but. Boy! I think there's. I think it's above. But there's one that I've. I've uh, encountered Draugr on one of these swinging blade traps. And he got, like, slapped off, and it was just absolutely hilarious. Yeah, I think it's up here. Oh, no, it's not. It might not be this dungeon that I did that in. Yeah, I want Relics of Hyrule to be challenging for people. I don't want them to just be able to go through it easy peasy. Alright, we're going to drop this shield. So I don't need it. Take that healing potion. Oh, that's the yeah, door is sealed. Sword. Scroll circle of protection, I'll take it. Why not?
Okay, so that's good to know. I can just blow air on it. <laughs> I can just spray it, and that will attempt to unlock it. Ooh, that's a master chest. That'll be interesting. Hopefully this is doable. Really doesn't help that the game keeps hanging. Oh, that is the butter zone. That was close. So it's right on that little shiny bit. Nice. Ooh, that was good. We got um, some decent stuff. That's not great. Um, but the uh, fire jewel is good. I think the game stopped hanging. Um, okay. Oh, I see, the crosshairs, the big crosshairs was uh, like a lock-on thing. Hello. Wee <laughs> Okay. Ooh, hey, a little chest. Dead man respite. Anything in here? I don't see anything. Oh, hello. I steal your money. Alright. Now we can unlock this thingy. These doors are really creative because they do a really good job of, uh, You know, you f you're forced to use the inventory system that shows the 3D model of the item. Okay, so it's bear, eagle, bear. Bear, eagle, bear. I'll take that soldier.
brown rot. Dang it. Oh, that's a redead sliding across the floor. Oh, I didn't know that. I didn't know that they landed on flying animals after they're unlocked. Didn't know that there was a pattern to it. That's interesting. I'm gonna go ahead and get this word of power. Ooh, he's he's a strong boy. Okay, I'm gonna go over here. Well, that was easy. <laughs> Ebony sword. That's pretty good. But she's focusing in daggers. Still take it though. Eh, I'm not gonna bother. Yeah, that's interesting. Welkin stone, I will take. Petty soul gem is good for recharging weapons. Oh. I think I actually have to visit Kagrenzel. Um, so I might... I'll probably be able to see that at some point. The whale skeletons. Alright. We cleared Deadman's... I didn't get the item. I had the key, but I don't think I actually got the tunic that was in here. There. Yeah, it's right here. There we go. Boom. Hero's chest. One of these days I'll retexture it so it's a little more unique. Um, instead of having all those swirls make it look a little more unique. Because right now it just looks the same as those. Yeah, Kagrenzel is... That's an experience. I'll have to look at Kagrenzel and see the context of the whale skeletons. Um, put my geologic, geomorphologist mind on there. I know it's in the mountains. Oh, Kagrenzel's right here. I already, I have already cleared it. Okay. I mean, it is. It's in the mountains, and there's. It's a giant vertical sinkhole, basically. So it could be, because I know the Morrowind. Well, actually, no, the Morrowind water. Like, there's water up here. It... Yeah, it is an interesting implication because, like, maybe these mountains formed by a tectonic action that uplifted. And but if that was the case, then the fossils would get warped and screwy. It wouldn't be a perfect fossil anymore. They would get warped. Oh my gosh. Get out of here. 
Well, now I have a million diseases. Do I have any cure disease potions? I do not. Yeah, you know it. <laughs> Welcome back. Oh, I need to be going north. No. Performance overlay. Get out of here, performance overlay. There's a snow bear. Yeah, I hear you. Thank you. <laughs> yes, uh, it's uh, been moving fast. I'm very happy. Just gonna discover this location. If they get mad at me, then so be it. Okay. No, they're not. They're okay. Wait. Okay. Well, I guess I'll have to cross. I'll have to cross the marsh. One of these one of these days Epic Mate will catch wind of relics of Hyrule, maybe. No biggie if he doesn't. It was already featured in a completionist video, not by name not by name, but it was still there. Ah yes, this is the ruin where you can find uh, Gem of the Swamp. Uh, I'll take the fire salts. Let's go to Morthal. See if Falion will sell me anything. I confess I don't know who Zakarin is. Here's this guy and his face. Warsaw used to be a quiet place, but then the world used to make sense. What you... Nothing. Oh, put <laughs> Whoever that was is dead now. Best offense is a good defense. I just passed it, didn't I? Yes. If you're here to purchase, I have many spells available. Do come in. I like learning about everything. Don't interrupt, young lady. The grown-ups were talking. Morthal is a troubled place. Take a look. Ah, I like... Your grand soul gems, I think. Let's see here. Fury, candlelight, frostbite, gust, gust, frost rune, water ball, wind rune. Could be useful. Zephyr. I think I'll take 
Windrune, and Zephyr. Bound bow. I think she already knows co stone cone flesh. Stone flesh. So I don't need to worry about that. See what I can sell this man. Okay. Zephyr and Quindrin. I know I know stone. I have to know stone. I do. Good. I. S I pay. Um, I do need to take an, a rest before I get a new skill perk. Bub has arrived. Welcome, Bub. All right. Thank you, Falion. What? It is true. Okay. Don't believe everything you hear, child. I said okay. God, stop, stop it. <laughs> All right. Let's just slap down the bedroll right here. Bit bop. Take a little nappy do. Falion will come out and trip over me, and he'll be like, what? New Animal Crossing update came out. I've been fooling around with that. I freaking love gyroids, so I am so happy that they're finally back performing for you. And I am going to look into getting the DLC as well, because that the very fact that you can eventually customize houses in your village means that I can probably fix one, uh, one of my villagers' houses that has been a train wreck ever since he moved in. Okay, there we go. I forgot to hit yes. <laughs> uh, let's do health. And we need a good perk. Any dagger perks? Oh, she was using... Yeah, I don't like the stalk market. I didn't know. I forgot that she was using axes. Well, since she's using uh, daggers now. Eh. I said eh. Okay. Ah, oh, beautiful sun. Yeah, uh, pumpkins are more consistent. You don't have to... My, gr uh, my fiancé hates that... Uh, hates Daisy May. She just hates the snot dribbling out of her nose. Hates it when that, that boar sneezes. <laughs> she does not like that little boar. <laughs> Hi, elk. Bye, elk. Oh, wait. I know the secret. Seriously? 
Huh. That is weird. It's so inconsistent. Ooh. Good old coelacanth. Gotta love that fish. When I, I remember when I was a, uh, a kid playing the original Animal Crossing, I was obsessed with that game. Like, I, I was... I caught wind of it before it came out, and I was just, like, super excited. I thought it was the coolest thing. Um... And then I found out about the seal cants through Animal Crossing. And I was just like, wow! A living fossil? That's awesome! And that's how I talked when I was a kid. Just like a stereotypical kid. Wow! This cereal turns your milk into chocolate milk. That's awesome. Oh, Relicanth, yeah. Oh, man, Relicanth. Hmm. Beautiful. That is a Wolfos. I'm gonna shoot that guy in the nuts. Let's see if I can... I know you see me hunting over. Yeet! That is not what I wanted to hit. <laughs> oh, Lord. Okay. Oh. I almost lost my mind. There's a great lift at Mazincha left. Oh, for love of dingleberries. Air is treacherously cold. Oh, no. We're almost to Dawnstar. See if I can get anything from the Dawnstar spider house. Which, in 6.6.2, the spider house tables will get a redesign to make them look more like ancient enchanters than slabs of rock. <laughs> Let's swing by, uh, that thing. Oh, there's a mammoth. Oh. I do not want to deal with the mammoth. I am very cold. I know a torch won't help too much. Oh, so there was that... Speaking of shinies, there was that giveaway of the shiny... Shiny Zacian and shiny Zamazenta. Um, and I didn't want to go to GameStop because I don't want to leave my house. <laughs> um, I just don't like... I never really liked having to go to a store and then just be like, Hey, can I have a code for a parking man? And... It just felt like... It was just weird. But, the European, the UK giveaway was via a website. And so I was like, hmm. So using my uh, VPN, I made it so I was in a different region. And I was just like, yes, I would like... <laughs> yeah. Well, top of the morning to you. I would like a shiny Zacian, please. Um, it was super easy to... I don't even know if I needed my VPN. But I... it worked. And I got myself a shiny Zacian. Which is great, because I have no intention of buying Pokemon Sword. I still have not managed to get a Zarude. 
I signed up for a trainer's newsletter and I didn't I didn't get the email with the Zarud code which is a little annoying I'm sure they'll do another Zarud giveaway sometime in the future. I missed out on Meloetta way back in the day, and I eventually ended up with one, so... It'll be fine. Alright, we're almost to winter hold. Yeah, I know I'm freezing. I will survive. Yeah, she's sick and she's cold. She needs... She needs rest. She needs some milk. I think they just give you a code, like they just give you a little piece of paper, a little card with a code on it that you scratch off. That's what I remember from the sun and moon days. I think it's the same. Mystery gift. I don't know if, I don't think there's a street pass thing. Not anymore at least. Hobbs fall Oh my god, dragon. Dragon just got deposited in there. Ah, the tower stone. I actually want to do something with the tower stone. Just a little thing. Just a little... I wanted to do something with the Tower Stone. I don't know if it'll actually... I'll end up doing it. Jeez. She is freezing to death. And I hit an invisible wall. Ah, yes. Black 2 and White 2 are pretty good. When, uh, oh man, I'm freezing to death so much at this point that the game thinks that Divine Light needs to cast constantly. That's not good. I need to get somewhere safe. She is freezing to death. Um... Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl are coming. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, Long Johnson. Okay, she needs... Where's the Winterhold Secret Grotto? Is it nearby? I don't think it is. Sarthal... Do I have anything on me that's warmer? Warmth is 27, warmth is 27. She doesn't have anything.
Well, Milotic. Milotic. They'll probably keep the prism scale. I think what they did in. They'll probably keep the prism scale. You might have two different ways to evolve Milotic. Probably prism scale or max beauty. I think that's what they had in, um, yeah, or us, yeah, that's what I thought. Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire had both. All right, let's keep trying to keep Miranda alive. Okay, she's fine now for some reason. Oh, right, there's a Talos statue. Why am I just walking right by it? Okay. That fixed my, uh, disease. I need to get to the closest interior. Milotic is heckin' dope. I don't want to deal with you. Okay, we have one of those now. Thank you. Come on. Right in the face. I do not want to freeze to death. Divine Light leveled up because I'm dying. We need to get to... Uh, the lighthouse might be the closest. this helps at all. I don't think it does, but... The lighthouse is my saving grace. Mirror coat! Wow! Yeah, mirror coat is a really good move. Alright, the lighthouse will save us. Gotta get inside. Alright, that was exciting. Jeez, she almost froze to death. by the fire. Whew. Let's level up Divine Light. What's a paladin? <laughs> this will be the fat, uh, the last uh, one that I put into it. Divine Aegis increases my armor rating for 10 seconds. Pain suppression decreases damage taken. Magic resistance. Restores health on nearby allies. Cures all diseases, huh? <laughs> Jeez. Decrease the spell's mana cost. Well, that's a tough one. Would never have to worry about disease ever again if I chose cleanse. Which I'm not too sure about. 
I don't know. Nearby allies, not really that. Magic resistance is not useful. Sunshine decrease the cost. I think decreasing all of these are very good. Armor rating I'm not sure about. I think damage taken. I think that's okay. I'll take that one. All right. Let's continue warming up in here. We can continue on. Okay, we have to get to Winter Hold, which I should be able to do. Oh yeah, this guy. Wolf. <laughs> Wee! I love this. This is just so cool to me. The frozen mammoth and the dwarven spears that are stuck in it. That's just so cool to me. And the meat's still good. Take the arrows. Yeah, the dwarven spears. And the uh, other suchness. Is that elven battle axe? I'll take the salt pile. Take the potatoes? Why am I taking the potatoes? I don't know. I think Dulce's Valsos could go through the College of Witcherhold quest. Yeah, potato soup. That yeah, would work. Potato soup. Ah! Get out of here. I do not like you. Thank you for dying. Continental Airlines. The Winterhold Grotto is right there, but I don't want to risk it. That's right, Winterhold is on the top of this mountain. But, 
I can get in the back way, so I don't have to climb it. Although I probably will end up climbing it anyway. What is that? There's like a plateau up there. That's interesting. Oh, it's Eskrimor's tomb. Oh, okay. I didn't know about that. I've never done Eskrimor's tomb. That's another thing I need to do is the companions. I think Jayut Gorok could do the companions. Animal that makes sense. Yeah, that definitely makes sense for the companions quest line. Animal allegiance. Okay, let's crack on into Winterhold, College of Winterhold. Oh, there's a goofy man. I mean, a, a flying Dagrin. Feralda's getting out of here. Ancient dragon, oh dear. Ow, 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 no, 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 I do not want to die. Okay, no, what are you doing? No, stop, stop it. <laughs> it reminded me of the, uh, um, <laughs> We are number one. What are you doing? Xavier has arrived. Xavier is late. What are you doing? <laughs> okay, so two things. This lady just sat down. And there's a dragon outside the window. And Savas Aaron, like, blew her up. <laughs> Hopefully I don't hit a... Excuse me. Yeah, that'll help a lot. F Frost Atronach. It's a great idea. Right on the noodle. Okay, that... She's okay, wait. <laughs> Wait, she, she's okay. That's right. She's, she's okay. See, she's okay. Everything's fine. This is normal. Um. <laughs> okay, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Okay, she died again. <laughs> Ugh. I was trying so hard. It probably saved when I was in Frostful Lighthouse. All right, let's try this again. Oh. Okay, let's get going. Set. Man, that's 
that's far. If only I had, like... If only I had paralysis or something, I could jump off this cliff. It's... Let's go this way. <laughs> There's that beautiful mammoth again. Love to see it. And then there's that. You hate to see it. <laughs> It was once so beautiful, but now it has crumbled and ceased to be. I love exploring these glaciers. This is my jam. Look at this guy. Just walking around with short sleeves. Oh. That's it. Again, I want to change that. I don't like... The animation just doesn't add up. He'll update it soon. And now I am very cold. I need to get to where I'm going. Yeah, see, like, Sword on Back isn't bad, it's just the animation just doesn't... I don't have the right animation install or something. I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm not here. Yeah. It's beautiful when animation mods work. I'm gonna pop into the Winterhold Secret Grotto to warm up. Ironically, it's warm. Oh no. That's a wolfy sound. Hello, friend. Go away. Oh, it's a golden fox. Oh, a red kinstone. Oh, do I have both parts? I do. Awesome. All right. Ooh, ooh. Okay, I'm going to quick save. This is exciting. We have a kinstone. We have a kinstone. We have a full kinstone. We're going to see what kind of weapon it gives us. So red kinstones give you a random strong weapon. So let's see. A Gerudo Najinata plus three. That's pretty good. That's really nice.
Oh, I don't have the Song of Time. That's problematic. Well, I guess I'm not going to do that. But I did get a Kinstone from that Keese, so that's really good. Do I have campfire supplies? I don't think I do. I have a bedroll. Okay, well, we took a little brief respite in here. And we got that Gerudo Naginata out of the deal. It's a strong weapon. It's a really strong weapon, actually. I might equip that. Twenty-six. It's definitely the strongest weapon I have. That swings with reasonable quickness. I think what I'll do... Well, the Noble Sword isn't super great right now. Actually, it's pretty good. It's doing better than my D Twilight Dagger, so maybe... Maybe Noble Sword should be three. I do need to reforge it into the Tempered Sword. But I need better smithing for that. So I guess what I should do... Is uh, invest in smithing. And of course Miranda's whole deal is that she's trying to... Remember who she is. So she's trying to uh, get blessings... Goddess Blessings. Alright, there's the dragon again. Oh, my Christmas. Alright, we're gonna... I think this is a high time that I use a Hylian Silver Arrow. Ah! <laughs> Good old Wilhelm scream. I'm not getting anywhere near that thing. Ooh! <laughs> See if I uh, didn't lose the silver arrow. Ah! I didn't lose it. I got it back. Nice. Let's get into the College of Winterhold. Oh, my health has gotten to a point where now Divine Light is just constant. Fortunately, I can sprint forever because of that. 
because it restores my stamina. Right, we're almost there. Ow! Actually, I wanted to go in the midden. Let's warm up in here first. Hey, Urag Grow Shrubs, where are you? Well, since he's not here, I guess I could just take anything. Here's the Onskultula's book. That's from Relics of Hyrule. Oh, and there's the Telkinesis Arrow Spell Tome right on top of it. Yeah, this is a creation club thing. Well, now I know that creation club has a little bit of a conflict with Relics of Hyrule. I can move the Onskull to those book. Where did I put my notebook? Oh, it's right here. some paper. Alduin is real. Alduin is real and he and Akatosh by Thromar Ironhead, Proud Nord. As my dad used to say, Imperials are idiots. That's why I'm writing this book. I ain't never wrote a book before and I don't reckon to write one again, but sometimes a man must do what a man must do. And what I must do is set the record straight about the god called Akatosh and the dragon called Alduin. They ain't the same thing, no matter what the Imperials might say, no matter, or how they might wish it to be so. My dad was never one for the gods, but my mom was. She was worshipped all the divines and taught me lots of things. So I know a thing or two about Akatosh as much as any Imperial. I know he was the first of all the gods to take shape in the beginning place, and I know he has the shape of a dragon. But they even told me the story of Martin Septim and things would happen when the gates to oblivion opened, and Septim turned into the spirit of Akatosh and killed Mayron's Dagon. He arm wrestled him to the death. <laughs> now, I don't know about you, but any dragon that fights the Prince of Destruction is okay by me. Now I know that you understand. I hope you understand the problem. Akatosh is good. Everyone from Nord to Imperial knows that. But although he ain't good, he's the opposite of good. That's uh, Alduin is evil through and through. You see, Akatosh and Alduin can't be the same as one of the same. Growing up as a lad in Skyrim, I heard all the stories about berries and cream told me by my dad, who was told by his dad, who was told by his dad, and so on. And one of those stories. It was not Alduin. It was about Alduin. It was about Alduin. But you see, it was not Akatosh. It was another dragon. A real, real one at that. Akatosh is some kind of spirit dragon, I think, when he bothers to be a dragon at all. And not a god living in some god place like Oblivion. But, if Al but Alduin is a real dragon with flesh and teeth. 
And the mean streak larger than the white river, longer than the white river. And there was a time when Alduin tried to rule over all Skyrim with his other dragons. In the end, it took my strong heroes to finally heal Alduin and be done with his whole sorry story. So now I got to ask, does that sound like I shot to you? No, friend. No, it do not. And so I, Thromgar Ironhead, do so firmly say with the utmost conviction that Alduin is real and he ain't Akatosh. Okay, capiche? <laughs> I love that book, and I wanted to read it, and so I read it. He somehow ended up sounding like a really angry Italian man. <laughs> it's one of the few accents that I can do. <laughs> Note that I said do not do well. <laughs> And now I'm on the roof. Okay. If I go to the Hall of Countenance, I can get into the Midden. That's the Hall of Attainment. Ooh, I could buy some spells. There we go. That's what I need in my life. Not Mountain Dew. Uh, cure Disease Potion. Okay. Yes. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Hey, wake up. Restoration is a perfectly... Spells and incantations. Oh. Oh. Okay. <laughs> she is amazed. She's gazing, gaze amazement at something up there. Uh, repel lesser undead, repel undead. Ooh. Turn undead. Turn lesser undead. I mean... Level 10 isn't great. Turn undead. Let undead up to level 17. Then what's Repel Undead? I'm in Tregwade. I mean, that could be really good. Turn Undead. But I'll have... I don't really have that problem. Why, have we, why am I even thinking about this? I don't have a problem with Undead. Expel Daedra. Undead. Oh, that's a better option right there, because there's Repel Undead, but then there's this. So if I take that and learn it from that, maybe. Maybe I'll drop it. Oh, wait, no, wait. So you wish to master the arcane arts? Yes. Give me that Grand Soul Gem, lady. Okay. I'm going to drop this scroll and see what happens. <laughs> what are you, are you from Skyrim? Base game? It's interesting. I wonder if I can learn the spell from it. I love that art. That. I, I really like how that looks in my hand. I think I think I used that for something. Oh, she doesn't have the spellcrafting trance. There we go. Now she does. 
Yeah, I think I used that for Hylia's... Hylia's acceptance. That's really, it's really nice art. It's just so pretty. It's so bright. And it just looks the part. That was just a scroll. And nothing. Let's do spellcrafting trance. Um, write notes. Analyze effect. A uh, yes. Righteous. Uh, fire and forget. Okay. First engineer item. Yes. Concept is within your skill, but a lapse of focus. Okay, well. Uh, write notes. It would be really cool if uh, spellcrafting did make a, a return. Okay. Restoration. Righteous. Ah! I wonder if she sells paper. Wake up and go to sleep. Why are my research material? Spells and incantations for those with a... Ah, dang it. All right, then. Hey, hey! There we go. Third time's a charm. So now I know Repel Undead, and I got it at a steal of the price. That's a lot of Magicka. We'll have to test that sometime. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, what do you do? Enchanting services are one of the few things Oh, I already talked to her. You know, they say knowledge is its own. So, you wish to master the arcane arts? <gasps> Why, yes. Yes, I do. Oh, he has turn greater undead. I don't have enough money for any of these things. Take a look. It's in a book. Yeah, I don't have enough money. Farewell. Oh, there's Ureg growing shrubs. Okay. That's a guy. Yeah, if like undead... If undead were a lot scarier in Skyrim. Like, even if you changed things slightly so that they could only be damaged by silver weapons or enchanted weapons, then the turn spells would be a little different.
Uh, Brambleberry has arrived. Welcome. Hey, there we go. That's why I'm here. Um, that is Goron Long. Uh, hey, Song of Time. Yes. Oh, I can I can reforge the noble sword, but I don't want to do that. I want to turn it into the tempered sword. I need two moon shards and four fire salts to do that. The white ring. Um I need to make potent light essence, so I need... Where'd my Hylian Silver Arrow go? I had one. I know I had one. I took it back. Oh, no, that was... Hmm. I don't know what happened to my Hylian Silver Arrow. It's okay, though. I can at least reforge this. Uh, let's see here. I have the Ocarina of Time. Because he gave it to me. Winter Moon gave it to me. So I can learn Song of Time. I did use it, but I thought I got it back. Oh. I used it to make a light essence. I thought I was making that from a grand soul gem. Serves me right. Okay. I wasn't paying attention. Okay. Bolero of Fire. That's Saria's song. That's, um, see, that one. There's those ones, too. That's... That's a good one. LG of Emptiness, okay. So we got that one. I need to get more arrows or something. Yeah, I'm not gonna get that one. I'm gonna, I want the, uh, where's the Dark Essence? Why aren't you letting me do I have an artifact or something? Oh, I have a... It's interesting. Oh, no, yeah, the Elegy of Emptiness is what allows me to make this. Let's see here. If I had Prelude of Light, then I would be in business. That's the Sun Song. So I had Vampire Dust... I'd be in business. That's the sun song. So I need vampire dust or dragon's tongue. Okay, now we have a quest to make a lot of uh, uh, cool stuff. I need some cool things. Because I have three gray gems, so if I had uh, Vampire Dust or Dragon's Tongue, then I'll be able to get some nice Light Essence Catalysts going. So now we have a quest...
Let's see here. There's a light shrine near the Shrine of Azura. And I could see if they sell Dragon's Tongue or Vampire Dust in Winterhold itself. Hello. Cool. Great to know. I guess I'll have to test these in battle. I think the Wind Rune might be pretty good. I don't have enough Magicka for it. Okay. Yeah, Zephyr is pretty good. That'll do. And Stone Flesh. That's a lot of fish. I'll keep Oak Flesh as my, my default. And then stone flesh will be if I know I'm going to get into a pickle. I can grab stone flesh, activate it. Now his. Uh, Now it actually makes sense that he says that because of the hypothermia system. Elvish T. Arcane authority, huh? What does that do? I'm not here. I'm just curious what it does. Oh. Shoot! <laughs> okay, well, I accidentally stole it. <laughs> didn't know it was a quest item. I didn't steal anything. Don't worry about me. I was never here. Okay, we'll have to come back to the Ancient Enchanter. I know there's one in Cragwall Slope as well, because I put it there. Uh, we need to get out of this treacherous cold. So... I could go up to the Shrine of Azura, to that light shrine that's there. Or I could swing down this way... to Windhelm. The light shrine is kind of a trek. But it might be worth it. I need to get Dragon's Tongue and uh, and or Vampire Dust. So let's make that happen. I have about half an hour left in the stream. I'm going to stop around 9 o'clock. Feels like I've been going a lot longer. Oh, there's a mine. Let's check out the mine. Although, I do want to climb 
to Azura's statue. I want to get that light shrine. Ah, hello. very cold. I'm definitely going about this the wrong way. But who has time for the right way when you can see the thing on your compass? That's a sight to see. I see you over there. There we go. Light arrow! Nice. Warm myself up a little bit. Oi! Okay. So now, let's head down to Windhelm. Come on down to Windhelm Town. <laughs> See both of our buildings. This boat is taking jobs out of Windhelm. We lead the nation in poverty. Our Jarl's an asshole. Come on down to Windhelm. Jarl is more concerned with running his rebellion than ruling Eastmarch. Whistling mine. Well, we gotta go in there because I'm gonna die if I don't. How's it hanging? Thorgar says we'll find rocks soon. They're telling you gold. Uh, what about rocks filled with gold? Step 
Dig up anything good? That's exciting. Well, best of luck to y'all. Oh, salmon steak. Oh, I should have grabbed that cabbage, and I could make hat hot cabbage. Yeah. There was a cabbage I should have grabbed. I thought I grabbed potato, but I guess I died after that happened. Man, a lot of things have happened. I don't want to steal their potatoes. Well, now I know. I can just grab some potatoes. I do have those fire salts for... Balamond, but I don't care about Balamond. I don't want to die. <laughs> How's it hanging? I'm not in the college. Oh. Didn't mean this ogle the grotesque. What's this guy's deal? Oh, he's just a bandit. That was a pretty cool uh, kill cam because she was like silhouetted against the, the white background. Surprise! So that'll cure your addiction. Roll a paper quill, I'll take it. I don't want the plate, what am I doing? Ooh, a treasure map. Hey, Relic's Hyrule book. down. I'll take them just in case. Wheat. Garlic. That's not bad. There we go. It's on her hip now. Ooh, there's a cave. Would you... Stillborn cave. Uh, I'm not going to bother with it right now. Fox.
Yeah, it is. <laughs> Burr is right. It's just nuts. I need to keep those fire salts for the um, tempered sword, though. And I think about it. I need moon shards, and I need more fire salts. I need to find an apothecary. It might actually be moon shards at the Terminum Forge. I need to go. You know what? I'm gonna go to Itnum uh, to Solstheim. Itnum Sand is on Solstheim. But that would have everything I need in one place. Make things a little easier. Port cast down. Don't worry about me, boys. I'm not here. That is a Stalfos. Nope. I saw the Stalfos. In version 6.6.2, .6 the Stalfos, well, the Parutamu will have more variety to them. The Parutamu are going to be blood red. Ah! Okay, they just threw so many things at me, I started lagging. I want to loot the Stalfos, though. Can I do that? I'll take all that. Thank you. Bye-bye. We survived. <laughs> oh, they're still chasing me. That's a storm atronach. That's not fun. Well, now we're warming up. Because we're getting closer to East March. Oh, dear. I hear you, dra uh, bear. Oh, that is... That's a dragon. Ah! Ooh -hoo -hoo. Well, we're just gonna have to deal with that performance overlay. I keep forgetting to see if I can change that. Guy just casually walking by. There's a dragon over there. We're gonna knock it out of its face. I slap you. Oh, Glacial Fortress, huh? Boy. Dragon Soul. Uh, okay. <laughs> it's definitely getting late because I'm running out of witty things to say. We're gonna get to Windhelm, we're gonna see if we can get like Dragon's Tongue and stuff, and then we'll hop on the uh... Oh, hello Saishin, welcome. We'll hop on the boat to go to Solstheim and we'll see if we can make some more Light Essence and maybe some Goddess Blessings to see if we can have Miranda remember who she is.
Huh. I think, uh, I think Leafer wins this one. Actually, I'm curious. Okay, he doesn't care anymore. Okay. Oh, we got a a saber cat just killed a wolfos and barely survived. I know this, these guys are added by Open City Skyrim, but and what might you do? Mm -hmm. I don't know what they do. Alright, we'll ignore all this frickin' dindolod nonsense rendering improperly. There we go. I'll be fine. Master, you're far too old for this sort of thing. You don't know what's inside. Hey, could I, uh... <laughs> I'll... I can... <laughs> uh, could I... Could I get one of the, uh... Hey, wait. Do you, do you have any? If there was a tonic that could help me, I would have found it by now. Yeah, could I have a uh, one of your? Uh... My master can be a bit short tempered, but I've learned so much from you. Can I buy any? Can I buy a? Alchemy is so oh, So you're an alchemist then. Okay. Thank you. Dragon's Tongue, yep, sign me up. Oh, he does sell vampire dust, wow. Uh, I don't know if there's anything else that I need. Jazz Bay Grapes. I think Nightshade. Yeah, the white file is really fun. Okay. Fire salts. I need more of might need more fire salts than that. Just a man's life work, Adal. Finally derived the location of the white file. This filthy busybody won't let me get it. They're in love. You would do that? It's good to know there are some people out there who are willing to help an old man. It's buried with its maker, Kuralmil, in a long forsaken cave to the west of here. Kuralmil is a crafty one, even in death. You would need the skills of a master alchemist to reach its resting place. Luckily for you, I've already made the mixture. Here, take it. 
days ago. <laughs> Don't dally. I've wasted enough time arguing with my useless assistant here. Why are you still standing around here? Go get me the file, you fool. Yeah, sure thing. Got anything good? Um, I guess that's. Oh, okay. I was gonna say that's one way to. Everyone says your uh, gray mane is the best slip in Skyrim. Scraping. That's one way to scrape a sc scrape. <laughs> Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Okay. Okay, let's head to where I need to go. Oh. Sorry to hear that, Nils. I don't know who his friend was. Take me to Soul Stein. Another day, another second. And then they take it back. Oh, hey, Shavi. Hi, beggar. Oh, hello. Hello. Have a look, a hundred gold pieces. Oh, Why not? Thank you. Oh, thank you. Fortunes will turn, and we have shelter, and ooh, we have not fared well outside our native Black Marsh, but we're determined to make the best of things. I began praying to Xenophar, the god of wealth, to bring us some fortune, but things made off with my sacred amulet almost as soon as I bought it. This is the first time I've actually gotten her quest. Shavi would be in your debt, kind one. I enjoyed our talk. Ooh. Winter Moon could marry her. I know she's a... a marriage... possibility. Gort. <laughs> I just wanted to talk to a man named Gort. I want to go to Soul Thang. Here you go. Right. Let's be off. I just did, genius. <laughs> All right, we're gonna get to where we need to get to. Um, see if we can make some more light essence. Or actually, let's first see if we can make the uh, Prelude of Light and Sun Song, and then we'll go from there. If you're looking for pasta, talk to Captain oh, for the love of... Do you have a five-second memory? Oh. I guess this poor thing was abandoned on Solstheim, and now it's following me. How adorable. Oh. What happened? What's going on, guys? Can I help? Okay.
Ah, paradise. Mmm, <laughs> breathe in that volcanic ash. Smells like heavy metals and pain. Oh, hey. Oh, yeah, this is, uh, Kilborn, Kil, Kilbjorn Barrow. Good old Prince Rallis right here. I don't have anything to give him. Niche. Might as well grab this shield since we're here. Out of the way, jerk ass. I actually really like this house. I might add something else to it, other. <laughs> Camera got drunk. Because currently there's just a Termin and Shield here, but I kind of want to add something else in addition to it, because this is such a nice little story that goes with this. Ooh, wind damage. I'll take that. Um, another wind damage. Magic shield. Yeah, that's it. That's all that's in here. I kind of want to add more. Health absorption, empty barrels, hello, um, game just locked up for some reason, carrot, might be able to make carrot soup or something, white cap, Ah, the lusty Argonian maid. <laughs> I don't want to run the risk of uh, getting in trouble. So I'm not going to read the lusty Argonian maid. Classic literature. Oh, that's... Okay, yeah. We're getting there. I don't need a torch in the middle of the day. I want to 
unequip the torch. What do you, what do you see, boy? Hopper. I mean, that's restore health, so. <sighs> Once again, performance display. Way performance display. Okay. Go away, performance display. <laughs> that overlay needs to go. Uh, whatever. There we go. Finally left. Ooh. I just need a canis root, and I would be able to... There was canis root. I saw canis root somewhere. I could buy it. Well, the most important thing is that I can make... Um, I don't want to waste that. I want to make this and skies are clear there we go now I can make light essence from gray gems boom I can make light essence, potent light essence, just from light essence. Excellent. Oh. Sonata of Awakening. That's min, uh, Requiem of Spirit. That's a Pona's song. That would be useful. Inverted Song of Time. I might as well do that. Double Time. Hello, game. Yes, I do. Serious Song. Bolero Fire, but I want to save that. Okay, so I have Potent Light Essence now, which means at some point I will be able to make Blessing Gems. So I'll, ho I'll start hoarding that stuff. Okay. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Very good, very good. Tempered sword. I need two moon shards, two fire salts. Moon shards I can get from storage in the archive.
Okay. We're getting there. We're getting there. She hasn't remembered herself too much yet. But we're getting there. Um, let's visit the spider house, and then I think I'm going to call it a day. Yeah, it's 9-12. It's getting pretty late. Get that ash spawn. Oh, Ring of Retribution. Actually, Quicksilver Ore is important. Okay. Let's talk to uh, the Apothecary and tell Mithrin. After I look at the spider house. Because she might have fire salts. Oh, big white Skulltula. She can afford the Stone of Agony. That's pretty neat. Might as well, why not? Nice. Okay. <laughs> it's functional. What is that? Alteration? Yes. So I can just use the Stone of Agony. Here and there. He's a good boy. I don't think you belong here. This must I'm just having trouble. I, I don't need to be rude, but I need to fix it. Okay. Now tell us from kitchen. Okay, it's locked. Oh, because it's 9 p.m. I'm just gonna slam down a bedroll and just take a nap right here. I'm gonna take a nap right here. I'm gonna take a nap right now. Good 10 hour sleep.
Oh yeah, I forgot about that. It's way over there. Come on, Mirak. Why do you have to do that to me, Mirak? That's not nice. That we might remember. Yeah, you know what? Let's let's zoom out. Let's uh watch her move. That came out wrong. I generally prefer first person, but sometimes it's nice to be in third person. How's it hanging, guys? Actually, I am looking for potion stuff. If you're looking for the All these guards sound like John Hurt, and I love it. Nobody's home. Great. Came all this way. I just want to buy some reagents. Oh, this is the apothecary. There we go. Looking for any potions? Ingredients? Ah, so you're an alchemist then. Canis root. Um, okay, she doesn't have anything else. Remember, I have plenty of potions and ingredients. I, st I need to get back to the Terminal Forge, and eventually I need to get my uh, bedroll back. But I can get the enhanced fairy bow, which is very nice. Oh, I have a Pona song. Weep. Alright, I'm gonna get my bedroll back for one.
And since I'm here... Oh, burn Spriggan. I don't really want anything to do with that. Um, can I get off of the horse? Thank you. <laughs> Seriously? It's not open? Huh, okay. Stewart's house is... Okay, I'm not gonna bother. Already here. Oh, tech tight. Let's get pay pay yeah, let's go to Palestone Camp. I don't have any moon shards, but I'll at least be able to make the enhanced fairy bow. I would have to go all the way up to Itnam Zand to see about getting moon shards. Okay. Oh, hey. Get out of here. Enhanced fairy bow. All right. Got the enhanced fairy bow. I'll water you. What are you doing? I think that's it. Next time we will go to Itnam's And. Um, I would do that now, but it's way up here. <laughs> and that would just be a real trek, and we kind of ran out of time. We'll definitely do that next time I uh, do a um, gameplay stream. Can at least repair the fighter's shield. Wonder if I can repair anything else. That, okay. Well, thanks everybody for watching. We will see you next time. Next week will be some stream. I don't know what I'll be streaming next week. If I stream next week. Um, but the next Relics of Hyrule stream will definitely be Itnam's End. So, thanks for watching, and see you next time. <laughs>